Opal Manta restoration on the go at the minute. This is my brother's car. We actually restored this car about nine or ten years ago, I believe it was now. Uh, it looked really nice when it was done, but unfortunately, time has passed. The car's been used daily for, for around six years or so by the person who bought this off us and it has lived on the coast, so never been garaged and suffered quite a lot with the sea air and whatnot. So it does want quite a bit of work again now. Got some ink. inner wings have got some holes in. Get my hand through that one. Same again over there. Inner wings broke through there and there. Battery tray is not looking the best. Uh, we've got the radiator cross member down here. That's got some scabs on it. So we're going to be going through this car again. We're going to be stripping it and doing another complete restoration on this and another full respray. I've already took some panels off it just to assess it. As you can see the wings, the bonnet, the lights and stuff are out. Which are all stacked up there. I've took the airbox off and the washer bowl. So we're gonna crack on with this guys. We're gonna get ripping into this. This should be quite a quick build, I would have thought. Shouldn't take us too long to do this one. From here back, it's pretty much all right. We've got a little bit of scabbing on the back arches, but we are thinking of uh, putting an I-240 kit on this. So the arches will be trimmed off anyway. That'll probably save us a lot of work. Oh yeah, there we have it, the old Manta that we restored 10 years ago is back with us, back in its original home, we're going to commence and get this looking as good as it did 10 years ago. So we're going to get these seats out first and the door seals and carpets and then move on into the back seats. We're going to end up taking the glass out of this car as well and probably take all this trim off which should be fun. So to get these seats out we have four bolts camera position for you. Got one there, one on the other side over here and then again the same on the back. So we're going to buzz these out, pull these seats and then we can deal with the frames once the seats are out of the car so we're not struggling trying to get under here. So that's both seats out we now need to take these runners out there's a couple of bolts either side and then they just slot into the runners so we'll get them out we'll get the center console out and we'll pull the carpet out and see what horrors are hiding under here
carpets out. Let's have a look what we're hiding. A bit. Oh, that's not good. Not good at all. Let's have a bit of a tap. Pretty soft. Check that out guys, definitely got a bit of welding to do, let's have a look at the other side because I got a quick glimpse of that a minute ago and it looks even worse than this side, yeah that's a bit worse, I don't even need to knock holes in this one, I think it's already missing, oh, I'll give it a tap anyway. Fair bit of work to do on this, as you can see. But we will get it done. We'll get all this rock chopped out. Get some new panels in there and make it all nice again. Right, so that is the end of day one. We've got all the interior out, rear cards off, all the seat belts out, we've got all the glass out, sunroof out, bonnet off, wings off, bumpers are all off, headlights are out, washer bottle out, battery off, and a few other bits and bobs, all the trim from all around the windows, louvers, all off. All put into storage. Next thing we're going to be doing is taking the dash out. We're going to be pulling the engine. And then we can set about getting all these inner wings replaced. Both sides. 
and then we're going to sort of move our way backwards towards the back of the car which doesn't need a lot to be fair there's, there's not an awful lot on the back end it's all sort of concentrated to the front of the car the rot on this one we're also going to be building a 2.4 motor for this and probably putting it on some throttle bodies with some management so we'll be getting rid of this 1800 what's in it at the moment giving it a bit more power so that is going to be it for this one give us a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe i hope you enjoyed this video drop us some comments and see you on the next one